And tell us where you pastor. At First Baptist Church in Lindell. So I've been pastoring there for 13 years. Okay. And so uh, you came from, before that you were in Florida? I was in Florida pastoring for 12 years near Tampa, just outside of Tampa. Mm -hmm. Where did you graduate from? I went to my undergrad work uh, at Moody Bible Institute and then went to DTS, got my THM there and working presently on finishing up my dissertation at Southern Seminary. Well, one of the things that I enjoy doing is working with uh, Simeon Trust workshops uh, where we train pastors in, in biblical exposition. So we spend uh, three days with them working through a book of the Bible and working on doing the exegetical work to prepare ourselves to better preach and better handle God's words. So that's probably one of the, the things I do that's the, the most fulfilling uh, outside of you know, ministering to the flock the Lord's given me, so week in and week out. What's your connection to the BMA Seminary? Well, um, I've known and been some way connected with the seminary for, oh goodness, probably 10 years. Um, our church, interestingly enough, uh, I think around the first 75 years, we're Southern Baptist now, but was BMA uh, originally uh, founded as a BMA church. Not sure how it moved to the Southern Baptist Convention eventually. So, But we do have obviously some historical ties with uh, BMA. And um, I uh, came to know Dr. Holmes through a variety of of relationships and connections. I can't even remember exactly, but I knew know that Simeon Trust was one of the things that uh, we bonded a relationship over over time. And um, I have just been thankful for this school, thankful for uh, what it, uh, its fidelity uh, throughout the years, its commitment to the truth of not just the gospel, but a solid theological foundation and giving that to their students. So I think it's one of the, the uh, uh, most best kept secrets in East Texas is uh, the BMA Theological Seminary here. I love love it, support it, thankful for the students and the faculty. And uh, you actually sit on the board here, right? As a, I'm what I think what they call a visiting trustee. So since I'm not a pastor of a BMA church, I'm not a an official trustee. But uh, the school's um, um, constitution allows for. Uh, a pastor to be a visiting trustee and because of my uh, relationship with the seminary and love for it they've asked me to serve in that capacity. And how long have you been a visiting trustee? This will be my third year okay. to do that. So two years ago uh, I began to serve in that capacity. Okay. And you have a um, pastor there in Lindale and you have several people who are uh, working there and going to church there, uh, how many of those people do you think go, go to the seminary? Well, uh, I do know that my associate pastor, who is Family Life Pastor, is presently studying here at the seminary as well, so we have that connection. Um, I'm not sure how many others have, st have studied, uh, but it's not uncommon for us to have students from, from the seminary to come and visit our church, but we're a little bit away Mm -hmm. So it's uh, quite a bit of a drive for someone to come to church, but uh, we're, our church has a, a strong love uh, for the seminary. So 